Recent viral footage spreading across the internet shows the pulse-quickening moments of a Russian pilot's desperate attempt to eject from his Sukhoi Su-25 seconds after being intercepted by a Ukrainian missile. The aircraft transformed from a fearsome war machine to a fireball, spiraling inevitably toward the ground. Amid the chaotic Ukrainian conflict, the skies have increasingly become an arena of peril for Russian pilots. As Russia's inventory of modern jet fighters dwindles, it finds itself increasingly reliant on its aging fleet of Soviet-era warplanes. Footage emerges daily, showing how Ukraine, though smaller in aerial might compared to the vastness of Russia's air force, has consistently taken countless Russian warbirds out of the sky. Armed with Western weapons and homemade solutions, Ukrainian forces are formidable adversaries in the aerial domain. For the pilot in the shocking video, the plight doesn't end as he ejects. In the roaring inferno and chaos, the pilot's grit becomes palpable as he grapples with the grim reality and braces for impact. Old Plane, New Skies The Sukhoi Su-25, designated the Frogfoot by NATO, was a marvel of its era, specifically engineered by the Soviet Union for the close air support role. Unlike many aircraft that later adapted to this function, the Su-25 was born for it. This Frogfoot's design prioritized flying low over battlefields and delivering pinpoint strikes, ensuring it was adequately equipped to deal with the threats at that altitude. One of its standout features was its extensive armored protection, safeguarding vital components and the pilot from small arms fire and anti-aircraft defenses. Its design didn't just prioritize durability, but also versatility. The Su-25 boasted a payload capable of carrying a variety of weapons, enabling it to tackle everything from infantry and fortified positions to tanks on a single sortie. The warplane was a testament to rugged simplicity, facilitating easy maintenance, especially crucial when operating from forward bases near frontline action. The warplane's short takeoff and landing capabilities also meant it could stray from proper runways and make use of rudimentary airfields, offering a higher degree of operational flexibility. The Su-25's cost-effectiveness made it an appealing choice for nations with constrained defense budgets. The aircraft's ejection seat, though, was where engineering met urgency. Given its role, a pilot's need to evacuate was a whisker away from the unforgiving ground. With such slender margins for error, the Su-25's ejection system was calibrated for split-second reactions, hurling the pilot clear and deploying parachutes swiftly. However, the evolution of modern warfare presents challenges for older aircraft like the Su-25. Advanced air defenses, especially the spread of potent surface-to-air missiles, have made the traditional low-flying close-air support missions perilous. To remain relevant, many Su-25s have undergone upgrades, ranging from enhanced avionics to sophisticated weapon systems. While its direct role in high-threat environments might be diminished, the old Soviet-era fighter continues to fight to this day. Last Second Escape In a harrowing turn of events caught on camera, a Russian fighter pilot's quick thinking and training kept him alive. In an unprecedented video shared on the Russian fighter-bomber Telegram channel, viewers are given a heart-stopping first-person perspective from within the cockpit of a Sukhoi Su-25 SM fighter jet. The gut-wrenching moments leading up to the pilot's ejection are palpable. As the horizon tilts and the Earth rapidly approaches, the pilot makes the split-second decision to eject. We witness the parachute deploying, a brief moment of suspended calm before the fighter jet meets its inevitable fate, crashing violently into the ground in an explosive display. Upon landing, the pilot's heavy grunt breaks the eerie silence, reminding us of the actual human being behind the camera, confronting mortality in real time. As David Cenciati, a noted aviation blogger based in Rome, pointed out on his site, The Aviationist, this might be the very first combat jet ejection footage captured via an action camera. The video's authenticity was also vouched for by military analyst Rob Lee, who shared the chilling footage, dubbing it, quote, crazy helmet camera footage on Twitter. This type of incident isn't isolated. A mere week before, tragedy struck in Siberia when two Russian pilots perished as their jet, the Sukhoi Su-30 on a test flight, crashed into a home in Irkutsk. This grim scene unfolded with firefighters attempting to tame the flames engulfing the wreckage, a testament to the inherent risks of aviation, especially during wartime. 
further darkening the skies over Russia, another devastating accident happened recently, where a Sukhoi Su-34, careening off course, smashed into an apartment complex in the southern city of Yesk, near Ukraine's border. The aftermath was grim, a loss of at least 15 lives and 19 injured. The spectacular pilot ejection footage and the other recent incidents demonstrate that the skies are becoming highly dangerous for Russian pilots, not only due to the efforts of Russian fighters, but also because of the deficiencies of their own forces. With a decreasing number of modern fighters and experienced pilots, Russia is relying heavily on older Soviet-era warplanes that often struggle to meet the demands of modern warfare. Add to that the fact that these aircraft are usually operated by pilots with limited experience, and the results seem to be this series of alarming incidents. Missile Strike Debate The intrigue surrounding the shocking footage of the Russian pilot ejecting from his Sukhoi Su-25SM just moments before its fiery demise has taken the aviation and defense community by storm. The video's immediacy and raw intensity have brought the often abstract concepts of combat and danger into sharp focus for viewers worldwide. Such intense footage invariably becomes fodder for speculation and debate with viewers dissecting every frame to interpret what transpired in those critical seconds. With media outlets presenting varied accounts of the incident, this has only added fuel to the raging debate. The first contention, that the pilot managed to eject just before the missile strike, is an awe-inspiring demonstration of a pilot's split-second decision-making and reflexes. If true, this would mean the pilot, having detected or been alerted to an incoming missile, made the rapid determination to abandon the aircraft. Conversely, the second version posits an equally breathtaking scenario. The aircraft is hit while the pilot is still inside. This would imply that amidst the chaos of a direct hit, the pilot retained enough composure to assess the damage and decide on an immediate ejection, showcasing his incredible training and presence of mind. Lastly, the more skeptical interpretation suggests the aircraft had already been struck before the video began. Here, viewers witness the grim aftermath the pilot grappling with the inevitability of the situation and deciding to eject from an already doomed aircraft. Regardless of which account is accurate, all underscore the perilous nature of combat flying and the immense mental and physical fortitude required of pilots. The helmet camera perspective intensifies the viewer's connection, thrusting them into the maelstrom of those fateful moments, from the confines of the cockpit to the dizzying drop to the ground below. Aside from its visceral impact, this footage serves as a stark reminder of the brutal realities of warfare and the daily risks military personnel face, even as it continues to be dissected and debated in forums and communities worldwide. Thank you for watching Dark Footage. For more incredible wartime moments captured in videos or photos, subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our videos. For more riveting war stories, check out our other Dark Documentaries channels. We upload new videos all the time, so stay tuned.